<laughs> so. I think mine actually broke because they were buried in my purse for so long. Well, you put piled stuff on yeah, top of it. Yeah, they're all smudged and scratched. <laughs> Shanir Barmore from the Rockford Area Convention and Visitors Bureau joins us. Welcome to February, the month of love. Month of love. Yeah. And the, finally, the month of the sun finally. Yeah. <laughs> so. Probably the past 10 days, I feel like. Yeah, but uh, so and we got a little Valentine's Day yes. kickoff here yes. this weekend for those shopping for a little love. Huh? Yeah, well, love. it's probably worded wrong. Shopping for a loved one. <laughs> loved one, yeah, correct, correct. <laughs> Love is in the air this Friday at the Rockford City Market with their annual Valentine's Day pop-up shop. Shoppers can celebrate the season with gift items from local makers and Valentine's Day themed beverages at the market bar. Mm. There will be live music from Kelly C Kayla Siever. The perfect This market is the perfect way to shop for that special loved one for Valentine's Day. Even better, admission is free and the market will be open from 4 to 7 p.m. While at the market, dine or grab a sweet treat from one of the permanent city market vendors. This is the indoor market, the I indoor assume, market. Right? even though the weather's going to be, be nice. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> but uh, this will be uh, indoor market there right next to the uh, uh, the outdoor grounds there, yeah. so right. and that is this, uh, this Friday afternoon. Huh? Mm -hmm. okay. Shop local for your Shop Valentine's yes. Day gifts. Yeah, yep. make sure you do not forget to get your loved ones some Valentine's Day gifts. Yeah, <laughs> I think we saw a story this past week. The average spent on a Valentine this year is one hundred eighty-five dollars. Yeah, Ooh. you can do a lot of damage. You can, you really can. Yeah, <laughs> come up with a lot of bags. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so be, be, if you just want to be average, that's what you got to do. Don't spend yeah. 185, 185 bucks. <laughs> I'll be below average this below year. Average. <laughs> All right, what's our second event, Shanir? We're celebrating the Lunar New Year at Nicholas Conservatory and Gardens. This Saturday, the Lunar New Year celebrates the Year of the Dragon with cultural sites, sounds, food, and activities for the whole family to enjoy. Food will be available, made for purchase from one of the city market vendors, Bop Bob. Korean barbecue and rice bowl on display for this this weekend will be a new exhibit, Whispers of the Zodiac, which examines the feminine odyssey. Whispers of the Zodiac invites viewers to embark on a journey through the 12 Chinese Zodiac signs. Tickets are only $10 for adults, $7 for youth ages 3 to 17, and children under 2 get in free. This cultural celebration will be held this Saturday from 5 to 8 p.m. And if you go to an event at Nicholas Conservatory and Gardens at night, it's always so, so beautiful. Yeah. Yeah, it, it, yeah it, it's something so beautiful. You it's, don't, they only don't, they don't hold a ton of them, any, but, but uh, it's worth checking out. Yeah. Yeah. That's, I'm trying to remember what year of, I think I'm year of the rabbit. You know what year you are? Oh, I, don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. I think I'm either rabbit or rooster. I can't remember. Well, we could, our crack research dragon. staff could, uh, <laughs> could probably dig into that. But, but that uh, might be a fun thing to look up before you go to the event. Yes, yeah. yes. Okay. Anybody, is, this is the weekend of the cat. Yeah, I don't think that's one of the <laughs> options, if I remember correctly. But just went it over can your be. head, right? Yeah. yeah. No, I know. Oh, I know okay. Okay. <laughs> I got you. Okay. okay. <laughs> Take it away, Shakira. This weekend, for all of their feline lovers out there, the 2024 Cat Show is back in the Rockford area. The American Cat Fanciers Association is hosting their annual championship and household pet cat show out at the Bricks in Cherry Valley. This show is fun for the whole family to enjoy, and there will be vendors available to purchase some cat items. Perfective cat owners can also see a variety of breeds and ask questions from experienced cat owners. I didn't even know there were over 70 breeds. Oh, there's way more but breeds Over than 70 that. <laughs> breeds participate in this competition. There are several categories, including best cat, best kitten, and best household pet. Admission is $5 per person, and this is the perfect show to check out with your family, and it will be held from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. both Saturday and Sunday. And this is a new location here for new years. New location, yes. yeah. out at the Bricks. Yeah, because it uh, had been at Forest Hills Lodge. Forest Hills Lodge for years. And, and many, doesn't many exist years. anymore. So, yep. Uh, yep. yeah, so they found, uh, found the Bricks in Cherry Valley there. And uh, so it should be uh, another good event. Mm -hmm. You probably know this. Do they take walk-up entries? I, I think they emphasize I, they do. They, they do for you the, know, the household, household pet yeah. competition. I don't mm -hmm. know if they take walk-up per se. You might have to pre-register, like you might still be able to register tomorrow. That would be, a, that might be a good They'll question <laughs> for a guest to tomorrow when uh, they come visit and talk more about moving from Forest Hills down to uh, the bricks. The bricks but, yeah. uh, but all right, so yeah, we got the uh, Year of the Dragon, mm -hmm. cats, and 
Valentine's, Valentine's Market. Day, yeah. yeah. So lots going on. Yeah, lots going on. Yeah. And restaurant week. And restaurant going on still going Sunday. on until Sunday. So there's still plenty of opportunity to enjoy one of the 62 participating restaurants for Restaurant Week this year. And you said last weekend was a big success. Big hit, big hit Good. for the restaurants. So. So do you guys? I mean, how do you just kind of call like you know, a sample of them and say how to go? How to go? Yeah, and they what? typically reach out and let us know. Oh, yeah, they'll um, let you know. Hey, nobody know. was at my place. <laughs> <laughs> no, not, nothing like that. Nothing like that, but they'll. Let us know that they've been grateful and people have been coming in and voting and it's been just great to see the participation this year from the community. What can what are the categories again people can vote on because if you vote you can you can get prizes right? dollars gift card yeah, yeah you got five categories best main course best dish best bite best cocktail or brew and best experience. So. Okay hmm. and you can vote through um, what's that what's What's the website? Well, I can't. I don't know what the <laughs> go rockford.com. That's the one. <laughs> that's the one I'm to go doubt. to. Just go to go, go rockford, rockford, right? right? <laughs> the new Google. Yeah. <laughs> and yes, vote for your favorites, and you could win a one hundred dollar gift card. And of course, keep eating this keep weekend. Keep eating, yes, yeah. and, and beyond, of course. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Shanir. Thank you. We'll be right.